Good day, friends. It is me, HL Mod Tech, and I'm back with the A8 Plus, and it's time for another stress test. So, my friends, let's get cracking. Alrighty, friends. So, once again, we are in Kira 4.7. I've got my generic ABS. The settings were 20%. I changed it to 10. Still using Cubic. Temperature 230. I'm going to back this up to 70. That was what the generic ABS had set, so we'll try it that way. I'm bumping up the print speed to 65. Still doing the skirt, four, and I want to create this awesome snake. Once again, I am going to save to the removable drive, but I want to make sure I label this so that it is different. I'm going to just edit and put an ABS in front of my little snake. And hit save, and let's see what we make. All right, so I have placed the SD card in. We're gonna print. Because I just added it, we need to refresh. And right there is my ABS HL Snake. Let's fire it up, see just how long it takes to actually get moving. All right, so I sped this up, but the bed took seven minutes to heat up, and then it took two minutes to heat up the hot end. I muted all the printer sounds, but now we can quickly watch it lay down that first layer of ABS. Remember, this is the super old ABS, and I'm able to run it on this printer, which is pretty darn awesome. I am going to use the clip speed so we can actually see it do stuff faster as well. Successful first layer. I'm going to steal back my phone because I need it, and I'll pick it up when it's complete. Alrighty, friends, so the final tally was an hour and 54 minutes. Let's see what we've got. So in the middle, it's not quite as heared as well as at the front, but it still comes off pretty easily. And as expected, we have got a sweet, flexible snake. Alrighty, friends, so I love it when a plan comes together. Uh, being able to use filament that's been sitting here for years is just super cool. A couple of quick things. We sped it up. It worked good, and we also changed the bed heating uh, to 70 instead of 90, which was easier on the A8+. Plus. It got there much faster, and everything stayed attached just like we'd expect. And of course, I got to use some filament that's been sitting around forever. Alrighty, friends, so if you enjoyed the video, please give it a like. If you got a question, comment, or even a suggestion for the next video, add it down below. If you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button. And last but not least, hit that notification bell if you wanna be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.